The past few weeks have been some of the tensest on the international stage in many years, maybe even decades. The United States and North Korea have tossed verbal and military provocations back and forth to the point where the two nuclear powers argued over if there actually had been a declaration of war. With all of this tough talk in the air, is there any hope that quiet diplomacy could be a way back from the edge? Well, I'm joined now by a man who served as a US diplomat across the world and as the Director of Global Engagement at the Obama White House. Uh, Brett Bruin is now president of the Global Situation Room and he is with us now. Brett, good morning and welcome. Good to be back. Thanks, Pat. Now, uh, let's talk about the current uh, situation where you have these verbal grenades being tossed back and forth from Kim Jong-un and from Donald Trump. What do you make of it? I mean, it's scary, but is it serious? Well, I think they're both playing out a bit of a reality show, but with very serious consequences. And and I fear that with diplomats not at the table, we run the risk of uh, getting into a situation in which um, we take words uh, and replace them with weapons. But has there ever been anyone like him as bellicose, as... Uh non-presidential, I suppose, in style. I I came in into the diplomatic service under George W. Bush, and sure, from time to time he could uh, misspeak, but I don't think we saw the kind of intentional uh, uh, effort to um, go beyond uh, what is normal uh, presidential uh, uh, language to describe events, and I fear we uh, are losing everyday credibility on the world stage. We are losing influence. And and we are going to need those allies, the ones uh, like Australia, that uh, in the early days of his presidency, uh, Donald Trump uh, belittled. And when um, the time uh, comes to take action on North Korea or or even on smaller issues, are the Australians going to uh, give their all? Are they going to stand up uh, alongside a president who has belittled their leader and who has undermined their standing in the world? 